If you want to remove WhatsApp from your phone, whether that's iOS or Android, stay tuned as we're gonna do that right now. Hi there, David Walsh here from David Walsh Online, where we help you grow your YouTube channel. Now, whatever the reason is for wanting to remove WhatsApp from your phone, whether it is the WhatsApp update where they're sharing your information with Facebook, you don't like Facebook's censorship, or you just want to remove Zuckerberg from your life. Oh? I'm gonna help you delete your WhatsApp account from your phone. And if you want to delete all your Facebook related accounts, that's Facebook, Instagram, etc., make sure to watch the videos at the end of this video where I show you how to do so. So to delete WhatsApp from your phone, open up WhatsApp. Now, what I recommend you do is to back up your chats before you delete your account. So to do so, go to settings or the three dots if you're on Android, go to chats and then click on chat backup. Click on backup now, and then it will back up all your chats from your WhatsApp account. Now, when you delete your WhatsApp account, all of these will be deleted from your account. So you cannot get them back if you decide to undelete your account. The only way you can get them back is if you have a backup. So even if you don't intend to go back and use WhatsApp again, having a backup of your chats is just a good thing to do. So once your chats are backed up, then go back into settings once again and go to account. Then on the bottom, you'll see delete my account. Pop in your number in here and then click on delete my account underneath. Pop in a reason why you want to delete your account. It can be anything, it's just text. And then once you've got that done, click on next. And once you go through there, your account will be deleted. Some questions you may have after deleting your account is what happens to the groups that you're in on WhatsApp? Your chats will be removed from them and it will just put a notification on there that you have left the group. It doesn't say that you have deleted your account, it just says that you have left the group. After you've deleted your account, anyone who sends you a message on WhatsApp won't know you've deleted your account either. The message will be sent from their side, so the message will just sit there. So they may think that you're ignoring them when in fact you have actually deleted your account. So the best thing to do is to let people know you have deleted your WhatsApp account and where to find you, whether you've signed up for Signal, Telegram or any other service. And that's pretty much it. So what's your reason for deleting your WhatsApp account? Let me know in the comments area below. I'd love to know your reason why. Now, if you are new here and you want to grow your YouTube channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button, smash that notification bell. We upload videos Tuesdays, Thursdays, and go live with our Saturday stream every Saturday, 6 p.m. UK time. And if you want to delete your other Facebook accounts like Facebook and or Instagram, make sure to watch those videos right there.